It roams the night, bellowing blood-curdling screams in search of dead and dying prey. And when it tears into flesh, it's with some of the most bone-crushing jaws on Earth. This fiendish fighter may look cute, but its name says it all. The Tasmanian Devil. Tasmanian devils, as their name suggests, can only be found in one place, Tasmania. This Australian island's forests and dense foliage allow a resting devil to lay low by day. But by night, the same landscape becomes a shrieking stalking ground. Tasmanian devils are the kangaroo's crankiest cousin. Like most marsupials, they start as tiny specks in their mother's pouch. They don't get as big as their fleet-footed relatives. Tassie devils only reach two feet and weigh just under 30 pounds. But what they lack in size, they make up for in strength. Devil's huge heads hold powerful, crushing jaws, and their bite is even worse than their ear-splitting bark. The Tasmanian devil has the strongest bite force of any living mammal on Earth, capable of ripping through flesh and bone. The devil's bite force comes from a powerful upper body design. The Tassie's massive head is disproportionately larger than the rest of its torso and supports an unusually prominent and powerful mouth. To date, Tassies have killed no humans, but inadvertent encounters with devils can end in bloodshed. One of the only ways to observe them is in protected animal parks. It takes determination, something head mammal keeper Tim Faulkner of the Australian Reptile Park knows firsthand. Come on. His routine devil checkup quickly turns into a howling scuffle. Hey, settle down. Come on. Anyone who studies Tassies up close risks painful run-ins with muscular jaws that work like a snapping sling. So you'll see that they've got a very large, lumpy jawbone. And most of that is muscle. It comes right up over the top of their forehead and attaches at the back of the ears and at the bottom of the ears and allows the pressure of the jaws to close. 